Yeah, like Fissure is their only half ass save inside of the Chrono. And yeah. I don't think that'll be enough. I, I would say that concerns me a little bit. Uh... Miracle up top. Cinder Brew. Kinetic Field. Is it going to be enough to save him? S4 looking to pursue. One more, two more. He's got it. First yeah. blood drawn by the Brewmaster. You could see him hesitating on that fairy fire. He was thinking like, uh, maybe. Maybe he'll turn. Maybe I can really hold this the last second. Oh, I'm going to try and pop it. Here, I guess, too. But Oh, the, the full bottle doesn't bottle up your disruptor. Oh, oh. I'm seething right now. <laughs> If I'm Martin, oh, mid lane. That's GH going down to a Sonic Wave. That's the problem when you try to do the switch to ruin mid. He tried to time it with the level six. That would have been pretty nice to bring back this game. But Limp uh, waited for the Hastron. At least he forced the Hastron pop before the uh, the cooldown was going to be ready for the Sonic but Wave. Now he's going to go use bottom. It down bottom. Yeah, Hastron in. Limp, no Sonic Wave for 20, but the scream will be enough to set up a kill on the GH, it looks like. And he'll burn down to the fire of FNG. Meanwhile, up top, RMN caught by S4. 940 HP. He has his bottle, too, so. Miracle. I don't know. When, when do you head to the jungle? I feel like it's it's coming. It feels like he'll just get more gold there. Yep. Oh, Chronosphere. Down bottom. Nico trying to live. On his way back, the poison and the fissure. We'll find it. A defensive Chrono to survive. And now FNG loses his path to retreat. Oh, dead. I, oh, with the arcane, I can't believe he didn't go. It, it's a, you know, it's a guaranteed creep wave mid. Frankly, creeps are worth a lot. Now he's in rotation down bottom anyway, so. Nico Baby again, down bottom. Big time damage. Fissure blocking him out. He's down again. FNG, limited resources. Limp, pops the arcane rune. Has the sonic wave, but pretty limited on mana right now. Make no, after GH, but he had no TP anyway. And he gets a stun totem. It's keeping Limp blocking the trees while the rest of the team focuses on Hanskin. They'll get another kill over there. Yeah, FNG. Weeha might go for this. He's still pretty healthy. Lasso up in five. He's got a few more stacks of sticky coming. There's the blink from Quap. FNG. Four stacks now. How far are we going, We One more. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, he got him. Style points. Flame break from downtown. Uh, an extended T1 for T1 exchange. Uh, from that potential point, chrono here. Triple. Oh, I don't think so. Static Storm, Kinetic Field, Dunk. They've got this void. No chrono, no time walk, and now Hanskin. He's going to be in big trouble. They'll chase him down. He burns to the Bat Rider. Uh, this is where that six second TP really hurts. Back uh, previously, this was like. Brewmaster's domain. But it's kind of felt like uh, Enigma are the ones to drive this game. They will drop the lasso onto S4 up top. Does have the Bruce split. But GH is also here. I don't think Bruce is going to be able to find this solo kill. Queen's coming. He's got another toss too, so he's just setting up. Oh, Sonic Wave connects on both. Very good. Limp, mobile enough to get there and use this space from S4. Oh, oh that's a lot of gold. All right, not the clean set of pickoffs they wanted. Meanwhile, in the mid lane, a big fight breaking out. Hanskin goes down first. Mind Control barely survives. FNG standing in Plague Wards. He'll be okay. So a two for two around the map. Oh, he's going to take out. Oh, the fountain sink. Some yeah. of the supports. But the Veno a bit behind compared to where S4 is right now. we split up in about 10 seconds. It's well worth it for where GH is. And because they're smoking mid, they're not going to gank him. Oh, Just RMN, a great Static Storm kinetic feel, but is it even going to be enough? They push Mind Control back. S4 oh, get the grab. Trying to split, but it'll be denied. They get a one for one. Mind Control for S4. Now the Chrono comes down. They find the Bat Rider. They find the Terra Blade, but they need to kill him without the Sunder. It's close, but they get it. A one what a for three. Big setup for a line. For both heroes. S4 down yeah. bottom. Oh, he's a little short on the lasso here, but he also needs a lot more damage before he commits it because there's a split. There's, there's no the static lasso. storm. They need some follow up. A little more. Brew, he's dead. Can't split. Blink is available here if they clump. GH can't punish. Mind control wrapping around the other way. The quap blinks to the low ground. And G moving into the trees, gets a Tinker Ward down to try to give them some advantage to fight here. Macro Pyre, also the Poison Nova though, a big dunk. Mind Control, probably gonna die. Can they get limp? 
No, they can't. FNG somehow survives that initial onslaught. He might just live in general. Another ice path. This one's off the mark. It's a really back and forth exchange, but now Void's here. No chrono for 45. Oh, first hit bash. Oh, two bashes. Oh, Weeha. Oh, this poor Bat Rider. I feel oh. the pain. <laughs> the Bash Lord is in town. Meanwhile, on the other side, GH and S4, they go blow for blow. And S4 that was like finds a win 50% there. bashes, man. That is brutal. He just needs a little. I like finishing that before the SNY versus TB. Right? Ranged carry. Yeah, That's meta's nice. pretty nasty. And he's even breaking off. He's not going to go full God King, but he'd be a uh, SMY earlier. Now, initiation oh, S4 nice. again, caught by the Static Storm. Can't get off the split. Might still survive, but no. Flaming Lasso's there. Sonic Wave connects on a lot, and it sets up the counter kill onto Weeha and GH as they burn down to the fire of the Jakiro. Now, Miracle set up on Mind Control, has the Poison Nova, connects on three. Void on his way in, though. Mind Control definitely going down. I guess he's Giants just trying to save Miracle, but man, that was greedy. All right, it cleans up one. Iron Man's going to kill on Hanskin, trade a Scythe for it, but he's probably dead anyway. It's gonna Mike be... and FNG with the, the ward thing, he's dead. All okay, right. so it's a three for four. It works out for Mind Control, a worthy sacrifice. TB does live. Uh, moving through enemy territory, hunting in the jungle, and they might find one. Roche attempt from Alliance. They walk into the pit. Giants right now, Terra Blade is not with Nigma though. This is risky. They're walking into a 4v5. Hanskin initiates here. The Bruce split does come oh, out no. despite the Static Storm. Dunk connects on three, but the follow-up's not there. The Terra Blade TPs to the outpost. He's trying to get to this fight, but now the Chrono comes down. Hanskin actually died first. They do get the Veno, and I'm kind of surprised that Nigma didn't get more there. Now the Lasso on the Void. They want Nico, baby. FNG on the high ground, they'll bring down GH. Nigma, I think they've overcommitted. Buybacks being used now by GH. Not available on FNG. Low ground to help get Miracle Weeha. out of here. Sonic Wave, another great flame break, knocks them all to the low ground, but Limp does secure the kill at the cost of S4. And they got Hanskin too. Man, what a strange fight. I back on Hanskin now. So I think Nikma just walked into the Roche pit, all three dead without buyback. That whole safe, but you're getting zero gold income on anyone. I mean, like one guy is farming the creep wave. Uh, it's, it's not great, but you got to respect all those ultimates available from Nigma. Could be a lot worse. They're just in this last hit. All right, GH carry us. They say they're all under vision right now. Next storm kinetic field comes down again. Nico with a chrono on two. Limps back though, not the ideal chrono. I think he survives. Maybe they can bring down Mind Control. GH also low in the back. They get two. FNG does go down, but now RMN falls. And it looks like Alliance have taken this one. Buyback used by the Veno. But Nigma not going to commit more into the fight. TB still has the Aegis. Oh, Weeha, you're crazy. He wants to BKB and grab someone for, for Miracle, but... Some scary yeah. stuff. A little risky. Uh, GH in the team fights, right? That's the goal. He's the big guy who can turn things around as well as like create those perfect moments for the Sunders to happen. You think you're getting the TV, the Echo Fisher comes through. That's the reset. That's S4 is just gone. Yep, no ulti. Although Limp does have the BKB, didn't use it last fight, and now he's got it. Sonic Wave is available. Can he drop it? They destroy RMN. It's a one for one, and now it's a two for one. FNG on the back. Miracle comes back to life with the Aegis. And Weeha obviously used that lasso, but trying to finish off Nico, baby. Oh, man, this is, this is a hard kill, though. Oh, he missed the, the scream. I got the dunk. I got GH in there. So he was able to get through with the, uh, the PKBs getting queued up. TBs not far off. Although, same for S4. He's looking for Magic Immunity himself. Uh, the, the, the window's not very big here. There's still a BKB back now on the void. So this is a dangerous jump. Come from Weeha, though. Does grab Limp, and they'll be able to kill him in time. Oh, the that's void. that's Static Storm stops it, but still pops BKB. Miracle stuck in the Chrono, but there's just no follow-up damage. He is disarmed, but Miracle is sustaining. Gets off the Sunder onto RMN. Now the dunk from GH. The counterplay from Limp as he's bought back. FNG dies and buys back as well. Stolen lasso from Rubik. They need more to kill Miracle, but he's just too big. Doesn't have a Sunder, but it might not matter. He's starting to trade right clicks. Locked down. Miracle low. Pulled back in. The raid boss falls. But heavy losses on the side of Alliance. They've lost Void, and now the two bought-back heroes are the only ones left. 
That was a five for one, I believe. Oh, and now buyback's they want more. now, too. A lot of buybacks in the Radiant. They need to clean this up. Mind Control in the front line, taking big time damage. They gotta They'll get go it. down next. Retreat. It is time to make the Exodus. <laughs> oh, man, that's... The... Oh, no, Fable! <laughs> oh, wow. How happy he is in the laning stage. It... It seems like bearable, you know, like he makes up for it in so many other aspects of the game that it's not that bad. 4v5 now, smoke from Alliance, they'll go in onto GH. Static Storm, Kinetic Field flies, and now the Chrono follow up Sonic Wave, but Miracle does get Roche and the Aegis. It'll cost him GH and RMN. Man, my control, he's got no friends left. Yeah, they only get FNG. A big fight for Alliance still, two supports on the sideline. Weeha, Miracle. I'm gonna slot that one right in. I'm just gonna move my Dragon Lance to my uh, neutral item now. That's pretty cool. Yeah, that's something. That's four up top. Static Storm, Kinetic Field, but where's the follow up? Just okay. Freak him out here or something? Uh, dead, okay. dead. All right, never They've mind. Got the follow up. It's too fast. Still 18 seconds on split. Radiant's top task. Mid lane, Weeha doing his stuff again here. Radiant. There's a BKB after this lasso. Against the whole team, he does have some backup. Not able to pull Void into no man's land, but that was the Void's seven second oh. BKB. Now on Kuba. Right, man. He Hook up too. Keep RMN invisible. Creeps on the way. That'll oh, Nico, baby, door. we hardly knew you. You could just see it coming. RMN is ready. A nice defensive sunder there. Dunk on the back line, does connect oh, on gone. two. He's gone, baby. It's a pretty deep dive, but Void has no BKB. That's three on the sideline now. No buybacks available. Nigma about to do it and take first place in Dota Pit 2020. Oh, it's our man. They call him the kid, the buster, the closer with the agatives. Oh, I love this hero. It's, uh, that's. You just got no option. You think you got a plan. You think, I'm buying out MKB. We got the damage. We can kill the Terrorblade. And then suddenly, all snapped away by a simple Aghanim Scepter. Ah, uh, went to the lair, picked it back up. And it's not just game. that he got it, it's that he kept it secret too. So the reveal was in the perfect fight at the perfect time, the clincher to end this in style. 39 to 38. It's Nygma that take the whole damn thing. Yeah, beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. I mean, Deserved through the way they played through this whole tournament, but my man, hands, hats off to uh, Alliance to to do that, to to make those two game comebacks in game three and four, yeah. thinking like, wow, maybe Nigma have faltered. Perhaps there's actually a chance here. The only team to take matches off of Nigma.